wanted to run We wanted to fall together Back then our world seemed so clear And crystal bright Shimmering lights around us <sighs> Guys, I know it's uh I, I know it's March 26th, right? But you see all those videos I just shown you guys, right? They're all clickbait. They're all stupid. They're, they are all claiming, Oh, John Doe, oh my god, I found him. Oh my god, he hacked me. Oh my god, something happened. And I know, yes, it's March 25th. It's basically all over. But I literally click on my John Doe video, right? And I got 10. I got 10 of those videos just from the airline. And I just googled John Doe and I took like the first 7 I could find. Like, it's honestly stupid. Like, it's just stupid how people actually clickbait people into thinking, Oh my god, John Doe is real. Why don't they make John Doe is fake exposing John Doe videos? Like, that, I'm not saying that's still good. But it's better than saying, oh my god, I found John Doe, I got hacked. And you want to notice something, you want to know how, it, not always, but you can sometimes tell if a video is clickbait by how long it is. If it's like 10 minutes and 2 seconds, it's chancefully clickbait. Unless it's just a, a really good video, which there is a chance. I'm not saying every video that's 10 minutes or something is clickbait. But you notice how those videos are 10 minutes and 2 seconds? Like, you get more money if your video's 10 minutes or longer. So people purposely stretch out their videos for 10 minutes so they can make more money off of the video. And that's profiting them while tricking other people into believing lies. I'm not one to make a story about trauma like this because I always resisted doing it before. Because I didn't, like, I didn't want to start, like, a fire. Because the fire spreads. And I'm probably going to get hate from people's, like, people that watch the YouTubers' videos that I've shown. Like, there's nothing against the YouTubers, right? But they're clickbaiting. Like, if this was GTA 5 clickbait, guys, like, do would never be an end. Luckily, it's not Grand Theft Auto 5 clickbait, it's just John Doe. John Doe's bad, but not as bad as Dr Grand Theft Auto 5. If you want to know how bad Grand Theft Auto 5 clickbait is, and just clickbait in general, look at Lipsy Jimmy. Just just look at Lipsy Jimmy. He is literally the clickbaitiest YouTuber out there. Like, if you want clickbait, then go to him. But that has nothing to do with Roblox, alright? But dude, I can't see these images right now, but like, all of the images, like, I have, a like, some of them have arrows, some of them have huge John Doe faces. It's like, oh my god, we discovered John Doe. Oh my god, John Doe's gonna hack on March 24th. Like, it's March 25th and nothing happened. I swear, people do this next year, then it ju it's just getting stupid at that point. You understand me? Because it's like, there's that much I could go on about this, right? But like, I just, f it's extremely stupid how people fall for it. I'm not saying that people that fall for it are stupid, but like the YouTubers that, like, not all of the videos are like, they're all clickbait, basically. Like, they may be like, oh my god, they may be staged or something. But other than that, like, they're all basically clickbait. They're, they are just clickbaiting people into clicking the video and making them interested in what's going to happen. Lucky, luckily for them, a lot of people do not notice clickbait, so they will not get much hate from, like, younger viewers, like, just like seven year olds, they won't get much hate at all because they don't understand really that much stuff about like John Doe and stuff. And they just watch a video for the person and not the topic. I'm not saying that's bad, it's good. I'm just saying like they watch clickbait video and believe exactly what they say. They believe every word that YouTuber says. Like if that YouTuber told Okay, I'm gonna even go I'm gonna even go and go there. I'm not even gonna go there, but if that YouTuber told someone to do something, and they're like a, just to say like, not saying to all people, but to like, just say it's like an 8 year old fan, right? And a YouTuber says something in this video, John Doe's gonna hack you guys all, all of you guys, delete your accounts before you can reach all your information. Then, 
the kid's probably gullible and going to delete his account. And then he's going to be upset because then he realized it was all fake. It's all stupid. It was just the YouTuber tricking him. And he, the YouTuber won. The YouTuber got what he wanted. He got the view. And the kid really didn't complain, probably. There's not much he could probably do. He just probably fell for the trick of the clickbait YouTubers. And that's what's horrible about, like, clickbait on YouTube. YouTube doesn't do much to stop it at all. Because, like, this isn't just on John Doe, by the way. I'm just saying that now. But, like, there's, like, Minecraft YouTubers and stuff. It's not as bad on Minecraft. But there's, like, Minecraft, GTA, like... I know this one YouTuber, I don't, I'm not gonna say names or stuff, but like, he creates, Oh, do not play Minecraft at 3 in the morning! Oh my god! Or, do not play GTA at 3 in the morning! Oh my god, you'll get wrecked, you'll get destroyed! Oh my god, it's so scary! Oh my god, I found, I found a headless horseman on GTA 5 at 3 in the morning! And... I'm not saying, like, like, there's Beijing Canadian now. And he's created a few videos on that, I'm pretty sure. Oh my god, do not play Minecraft. Do not play Egg Wars at 3 in the morning. It's really bad for you. It's like, the YouTuber is good, but not the content that they create. They create, uh, clickbait content. Not all the time, for, except Lip Lipsy Jimmy. If you talk about Lipsy Jimmy, uh, yeah, he clicked creates clickbait all the time, literally. But other than Lipsy Jimmy, not every YouTuber creates every video as clickbait. I'm just making this basic, like, Comcast. It's not a long one, but I'm just making this basic video just to say, do not fall for those tricks. Do not fall for those people that clickbait. If it looks like, oh, do not do this at 3 in the morning. Oh, I messaged John Doe, a legendary hacker, and he said he hacked me. Why would they upload a video if he said they'll hack them? Like, what? <sighs> it's just simple logic. It's like... Like, if... I'm just saying, if I want to continue on putting more images of John Doe videos, I could continue it for ages. And you see how many views, like, a few of them has... Like, I saw one, I'm pretty sure one of them has, like, 750,000 views. And that means probably one-fourth of those views, a quarter of those views got tricked into thinking John Doe is real. And that's not good. Because if they fall for that, then that's just, as I said before, profiting the YouTuber with the money from the views. And not all of those videos are more than 10 minutes long. But still. But still, man, it's stupid, man. It's stupid, but I'm going to basically wrap off this episode here, guys. And if you guys did enjoy, make sure to slam that like button. But the message of this uh, Comcast episode, Comcast podcast, it's not really a podcast since I don't have a another person, but, you know, I'm, it's not like I'm interviewing someone, but it's sort of like a podcast. Um, like, just talking about topic. It's like x Dodge Gaming x Weekly Report, but, like, not focused on, like, the YouTube channel. Which is pretty good, but the theme of this episode is, guys, don't be gullible on YouTube. You're probably gonna be seeing videos like, do not play blank 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 at 3 in the morning. Oh, I got hacked by blank 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 blank. Like, that was a bad example since some of them you may actually get hacked. Like, don't fall for clickbait. That's the entire message of this episode. Clickbait is everywhere on YouTube. If you get w one wrong video, then you got an entire thing of clickbait following you. There's something I forgot to mention, too. There's lots of videos from these YouTubers. I do, like, how to get a million Roblox for free on Roblox. It's like, if you like plus favorite this, if you like, what's it called, thumbs up plus subscribe, you get a million Roblox and comment, like, they're just tricking you to like their video and subscribe to their channel. You're not going to get anything. None, no free Roblox works. N none of it. Roblox won't give out free money. 
Like, it's like you going to a bank and saying, uh, can I have some free money, please? It's like they need to make a pro- wait, that's a bad example, but you know. Like, they need to make a profit off of their game. If they didn't have people paying for, like, Roblox, then they- it, I'm not saying the game would be dead, but it would be less- It wouldn't probably be as good, because they wouldn't have as enough money to get workers and stuff. And they need money from the Roblox. If you're basically, like, trying to create videos, how to get free, this, 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 and actually, well, you're ripping off the person that made the game, excellent game for you and you're just ripping them off because they need to make money from what they make it's not something everyone likes but it's just like life if you work if you're like a developer and that's like your job every day you need to make money off of it so it's like don't expect okay goodness i thought this video was just gonna be over 10 minutes this video will have been clickbait but i'm gonna just stop this discussion here guys I think I went on enough. Just don't be gullible for these clickbait videos and all that good jazz. If you want to see more of Comcast, just leave a like and all that good jazz. I was kind of skeptical about starting at, at first, but I was like, ooh, it might be a good idea. So that's how this video came to be. I might have put some more screenshots at the end. I don't know how I'm going to do this but i do hope you guys enjoyed this episode if you guys did make sure to slam that like button down below i'll right, see you guys next time peace <laughs>